a good record for Hansi Cronje, part-time bowler, economy rate just over four. McMillan's claiming the catch and Steve Buckner's giving him out. That's a brilliant catch from Brian McMillan. And the first Pakistan wicket's down. They're 52 for one. The crowd can't believe it, but Brian McMillan sure can. Said Anwar going for the extra cover drive. Fiercely hit. Another great catch for the world's leading all-rounder, Brian McMillan. Pakistan, 52 for one. Jez Ahmed, number three for Pakistan. That's very straight. And he's gone. He's gone, second ball, another wicket for Hansi Kronje. Steve Buckner thought about it long and hard. The finger went up. Ijaz Ahmed goes without scoring. Pakistan 52 for two now. That's changed the whole complexion of this match. Then we'll see Hansi Kronje bowling from... It was pretty straight and uh, there was no doubt in Hansi's mind and umpire Buckner agreeing to that play from Kroni and what a brilliant over for South Africa. Ijaz not troubling the scorers, Pakistan 52 for two. At the crease, Hansi Kronje, the South African captain, with lots to do. This game been dumped back on its head by the Pakistan off-spinner. It's Hansi Kronje's career average. Under 40, he'd be satisfied with that, 200, 14 50s. That's a big hit, and it's going to be four rounds. Six. No, it's a four. And let's watch that again. And that's uh, through for four. Mustak the bowler, short, and it's pulled to deep mid-wicket, and that could be four runs, over the boundary it goes, and Cronier waited for that one and placed it between the two fielders, four runs, 220 for five. Well, I said a long time ago, he's a very fine player of spinners, this is a South African captain, he just waited for this, picked his spot, there are two men out on the boundary, but he placed it perfectly between two of them. Tired of 36 deliveries. It's all over by the shouting as far as Pakistan are concerned. And that's played out to the deep cover area, the sweeper position in Zamam Fields. And it's Trey. For South Africa.